Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I am Suma from Decreate Academy. Here in this video, I will show you how to create this awesome sneakers landing page using Elementor Pro Page Builder and some free plugins. Don't worry, it's free. So, this is the headings and this is the color headings and this is the buttons. If I'm hovering on it, you can see this is the cool hover effect with text and the background color and this social media icon. So, I'm hovering on it, you can see this is the pulse grow up over animation and that's it. This is the, and then this is the arrow button. So, if you click on it, you can see the big image will change. That's the it and this search bar if you click on it it will come with, with cool hover animation with light box so that's the landing page we have to create in this video so i am creating it from scratch and at first i am going to the wordpress dashboard so this is the wordpress dashboard and i am creating it from the another pages so this i am creating one more pages so i am just writing nike sorry nike sneaker that's it then i am disable this title and customer settings will be stressed then just publish it and then view the page and into the elementor and i'm deleting this just deleting this deleting this tab and then deleting this tab you can see here this game i am use, use, choosing the elementor canvas template so should choose the settings click on the settings and then elementor canvas and update it just and up reading this page you can see this is the nothing and fresh page so at first i am using this is the elementor skit so to create this elementor just plug in go to the plugin let me show you how to install this just go to the plugin section and add, add new then just type here elementor you can see this is the if I, if you search elementor this is the element ski this is the plugin this is the free plugin this is the most popular plugin and best plugin for elementor so just install it and activate and i'm closing the tab and this is the this is the element ski so i'm just using one header so this is the click on it then click on the header you can see this is the header will came and just insert it i'm using it using the pre header sections because to time save the time mm -hmm. because we have to make the transparent header and click on it i am selecting main menu at first we have to create a menu before using this then click on it then choose the image i am choosing my logo so i'm selecting this logo then to change the color sorry before this i have deleted this deleted this section then click on the section to change the color background color and then click on it then just and i'm reducing this color this color so i'm just writing this position that's fine then click on the menu and go to the style tab and menu item style there this is the item text color will be black you can see this is game then click on the plus icon and create its heart menu so a search so this is the header search the elementor kit which i have installed we have which i have shown in the plugin section so header section just install it and then this is the icon library so i'm i don't want this icon so i have to make change the icon just click on the library click on the icon library and this is the search bar so i'm searching just search this is the search icon i mean it. this game if i click on it you can see this a cool hover effect came in the search bar so that's the header if I now update it, you can see this is the page will be came. So that's the page page came. And click on it, then click on the logo and writing to the center right. Sorry, my alignment right. And then I'm reloading this page again. You can see here this is the came. So header will be completed. Then we have to make the hero section. So click on it and this, I'm selecting the structure. So click on the section. And then go to the advanced tab, unbind this padding and top will be 20 pixel and bottom will be 150 pixel. That's it. Then click on this. Sorry, click on the section to change the background color and background type. And then I'm copying this color. So copy it. Then just paste it here. You can see this is came. So we I'm reducing this size to 
this color this is perfect then just go to the plus section and i am adding one more heading so i am copying this heading so this is the heading i am copying this and go to the style tab and text color will be black pure black and then typography will be poppins i am always choose poppins so this is poppins and then size will be 65 pixel and then this is the line height line height will be 70 pixel it's fine 75 it's look fine then click on it and section click on the section and go to the advanced tab and i have forgot the padding so right will be 20 pixel and left will be 20 pixel that's look fine then update it then i have to make one more header so just placing the header again and then click on it and i am copying this header this is a sneaker so just paste it here and go to the style tab and this is the blue color so just i am copying the this is the blue color you can i am choosing anything this is the blue color i am choosing and then go to the typography and pop ins and then this is the font size so i am giving the 25 pixel and giving the font weight to 800 that's it and then update it then you have to make the this price section just copy this is the text editor just click on the ruby square icon and placing the text editor and just sorry this is the other place you click on it then click on it this is the reloading page is loading again so for this and then click on the text editor and just placing it here then i am writing this the buttons and then click on the style tab and text color will be black and the typography will be again pop ins and then the size will be fine and just update it you can see here all the shapes will be came so that's it uh, this is the game and then we have to create the buttons so to create the button click on the ruby square icon and search here button so just place it again and then click on it so this is the add to cart and just copy it and paste it here add to cart then click on the style tab sorry click on the content and this is the icon library to add the icon library click on the icon library and i am adding shop so this is shop and i am inserting it again then i have to, i don't want to before so i'm giving the after then icon spacing will be 10 pixel that's fine then go to the style tab and text color will be pure white and the background color background color will be the blue color sorry transparent transparent and the text color will be blue color so the blue color This is the pure blue color you can see here this is a pure and the border disk and this this is solid so i'm giving the solid and then width will be 2 pixel and border disk will be 35 pixel that's fine then go to the hover section and then text color will be white and the background color will be this is the color i'm copying the color copy it and then go to the hover section and background color will be this color if i hover and you can see this game but i don't i don't want this this change hover effect i don't want more i want to make the icon will be white and the background color will be this blue color you can see here this is the cool buttons so to make it we, ha we have to write some css codes don't worry i will provide you in the description box so click on it then just click on then padding padding will be first 13 pixel then right will be 25 pixel and 13 pixel and then 25 pixel that's fine then i am i have to make the box shadow to make the box shadow just click on the home horizontal and the vertical you can see here this games and then blur will be 30 pixel 30 and the background will be one point one 
just 0.1 that's it you can see here one box head will came that's it this is the four and this is is the update so i'm gonna update it then just loading this page you can see here this came you can click on it you can see this that what add to cart button came i want to make this color of button so to make it click on the click on the buttons and then this is the border color so we have to make the border color to border color this is the border color i'm copying this color this is the colors and this the i'm just paste it here you can see this came so then update it and loading this page you can see here this came then we have to make this icon so to click this then i am just inspect it and i will providing you the css code so just i am copying the css here from here so this is the icons if you can see here this is the codes so just copy it from here just copy it from here and i'm using this point before and then just paste it here and click on it and then go to the advanced section and then this is the custom css and just paste it here you can see this came so just update it i'll provide this css codes in the description don't worry so click on it then you can see here this came then we have to make this this is the image so just to create it at first this is the reducing the font weight this is the font weight is too high I'm reducing to 500 it's fine then update it and just reloading this page that's fine then go to the image section this is the slider this is the media slider you can click on it you can see this is the games so click on it then i am writing carcel so so this is the media carcel and then place it here and just writing this and then this effect is fade effect and then click on the item to choose the image i am choosing this image and then i am choosing this image and additional options this is additional option this is sliders sorry i don't want this slider i have to make one more another slider so this is the image carcel i have to make this image carcel but not media slider so just click on it and choose the image from here and insert gallery you can see this game then just image stretch go to the image stretch and i'm using slides to scroll one and this is the one you can see at this game just i'm showing how to create that so i'm i'm going to the section to create how to create this i'll show you how to create so just going to the then click on it you can see here this is the major image carcel that's the same while i'm using so just click on it and just thumbnail medium that's it that's fine then i have you can you see me see that this is the background image so to create that click on the column icon column icon before this we have we have deleted the dot buttons this is the dots so so to delete the dots just here arrows select arrows you can see here this is the arrow scheme but we don't see that like these arrows you can see when we i'm using the custom cs codes you can see this is the here. arrow will be came position this is in this place so i'm using writing it from here so this is the arrow so click on it sorry i'm deleting this then the elementary page again 
to copy the cop CSS codes don't worry I'll give you in the description you can download it and just use it go to the advanced tab and custom CSS and this is the CSS codes so just copy it from here and I am pasting it to save the time I don't wanna bore you so this is the cam this cam you can see here if you click on it the Jimmy big image will be changeable so to create the background circle border this is a background circle this is the background circle just click on the column icon then go to the style tag and background type will be gradient and then this is the background color so I'm I'm just keep the color picking the color so this is the color and then just go to then and I'm pasting it here here you can see and the color this color will be this color and the second color will be same so I'm just writing this color to this that's fine then this is the location so I'm writing the sorry I'm uh, giving the border so border radius will be 300 pixel you can see this game if you are closing it you can see this game and then this is so big so we have to reduce just keep it and just update it and click on this then content and additional options and this is the 5000 i am giving 2000 to speed i am increasing the speed of our, this is speed so just time when i am clicking on it you can see this is this changeable this fast changeable and this is the column giving the column and give go to the advanced tab and writing the padding will be 30 pixel that's it then update it then loading page Here you can see this game then we have to then we have to change the size you have to you, i must have to giving the padding so click on it then i am using spacer so this is spacer and just update it and just loading space you can see this is the game and this is also came and this is the game arrow button came and this heart button came now we have to just create the social media icons hovering social media icons to create that just go to the rubik click on the rubik icon and click social media so this social media icons and click placing on here and just go to the style tag and custom color and secondary color secondary color will be i'm copying this i'm just copying this color secondary color will be this color and primary color will be transparent so it will look more better then just update it and i'm again copying the css codes and you can download it from description box i'm CSS, i'm copying the css code from here and just go to the advanced i'm copying the css codes to here we can here i am hovering on it you can see there is no hover effect so to create the hover effect click on the style tab and this is the icon hover secondary color will be blue color so i am just pick the color and copy it and just paste it here when i have been hovering on it you can see this is the hover effect came this is the hover animation if i click on it and choosing the bob if you click on it, you can see this is the pop hover effect on so just update it and it will this page you can see this is game so to change this then click on it just go to the advanced tab and custom css and this is the right so i'm giving the right to 50 pixel i'm just deleting this and just update it and then i'm just inspect it and this is the element of social media we can see here this is game this is social media icons and this is the arrow buttons if you click on it you can see here this is game and this is the price section and add to cart button and this is the search buttons if you click on it you can see this is a blur it will came and the headings so that's the video see you in the next video till then bye bye and thanks for watching